Ladies and gentlemen, beautiful people, the auction event is once again back. Uh, sorry, I missed the yesterday's uh, auction, the video about the auction overall, which was the 22, because uh, uh, family is sick right now, so I'm taking care of the family. I'm not able to stream that much. I'm not able to, you know, check World of Tanks out and, and uh, do content, you know. I need to take care of people, but guys, I am here today and we have a brand new tier 10 tank up for sale for a minimum bid of 22,500 and uh, we have 4 hours left in the auction on the EU server at least, the 15,000 items and we actually do not have 15,000 bids uh, done because otherwise we would see the competitive bid, we would see the number of participants and everything, but uh, you know, it's quite a hefty starting price, let's say 75, 76 euros, depends where you live, maybe more, maybe less, around that, let's say. And uh, this is a, a tier 10 uh, Chinese jet-boosted heavy tank. It's, uh, you know, like fits uh, next to the beast at uh, 75, for example. So today I had finally some time to do stream and um, I was actually playing 22 battles in total with it on the stream. And I'm just going to show you some of my first impressions uh, battles uh, which I had with it. Uh, I can say that at first I didn't think much about that, but at the end I started liking it a bit more, but still Still, it has uh, quite a lot of issues and uh, we talk more about that later in the video. Uh, so what I'm going to show you is um, battles because I, I think you would like to see this tank in action. How it works, how it performs, what is good, what is bad about this tank, how it feels overall. So this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to show you a couple battles which I had uh, during the live stream today. And then uh, we are going to talk about this tank a bit as well. So enjoy the show, ladies and gentlemen. And uh, man, it's good to be back. So first up, we have a battle which I had on highway. Quite an interesting one, full tier 10. We have light tanks, uh, uh, artillery over here as well. Tanks are flanking us. Interesting things are happening. And over here, pay attention on the power of boost when going up the hill. That 2500 PHP is actually very very strong so let's jump into the live commentary now i'm not going to use my boost guys because on this map i could use those a lot i'm going to use it up the hill by the way look at this now look at this boom this thing has horsepower like 47 like look i'm top speed going up the hill this is how nuts it is i see so many uh, BZ players, so many jet booster dank players doing the mistakes like just overusing their boosts at the start of the match. Simply overusing their boosts. When in the late game, this is like the best thing you can have. Ah, shit. Come on. What is that? Thank you. Thank you, Granman. Crane wagon. Uh, who else? 50B, maybe? Maybe 50B if 50B stops sniping. Or IS4. 567. Beautiful number. Big Kunaki, thank you for 29 months, by the way. I didn't even see the guy. Like, I legit didn't even see the guy, and he was able to bank middle of my commander hatch. Hmm. Okay. Well, we learned something new. Every every battle about this tank. We need to just chill over here, because they have more tanks. They have more tanks. They have more things up here. So you can penetrate my roof as well. Holy shit, that tank does not have armor, guys. This tank does not have armor. Like, straight out, it does not have armor. Um, I tried to get an angle on the CS. Maybe. 
Okay, I has four move up as well. All right, all right, all right, all right, guys. This repositioning may work out. It can work out. I'm still not sure if they have... Okay, there it is. We hit it! Gamer. Nice. Good. Leo is still back there. Ooh, Effie as well. Shh, chat. Shh, be very quiet. Be very quiet. Boom. Hmm. Hopeful. Okay, let's finish off IS-4, hopefully. Effie pulled back, right? I may take another shot from Leopard. But IS-4 is dead. I actually was just saying that, that I may take another one. Hello, Manti. Oh, 604 straight in the nuts. Straight in the nuts. I felt it myself. Let's go. Thoughts about the BZ so far? Average. My thoughts. Guys, look at that shot. Are you ready? Okay, he stopped. Let me stop as well. Boom. Oh! I have boosts left, so let's go in. Let's do some gilling, and then maybe we need to go back to decap. Bro, do I need to go back right now? Oh no, okay. Nice. Actually not. Actually don't have to. But this guy could be a huge nuisance up in my butt. Hopefully Krilla will deal with it. Nice. Alright, our six is clean. Eskonk is just so much better. Just so much better. I was aiming in. I was going to let that shot aim in. No! No, 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 no! <laughs> <coughs> this guy has gone depression for bloody years. Mm. So close. So close. This guy legit has gone depression for years to come. Uh. F, yes, F in the chat, man. I was like, guys, I, I, I kid you not. I was going to ram that Eskong. I was actually going to full ram that Eskong with the chat boost on. Next up, however, guys. Um, not a lot of damage will be done, but I decided to push the one line, which you're able to do in the faster ranks just to get some spotting going. And, uh, well, we did have some interesting things happening. Uh, and the ending of this battle is especially interesting. Is it a good way or a bad way interesting? Well, you have to find out. Enjoy. Maybe, guys. Okay. Okay, let's let's test this out. Let's test. We, we have mobility, right? We have mobility. That's one thing we do have. Maybe we can use it to boost the one line. Starting position for that one line bush could have been a bit better. We'll see. I will use most of my boosts.
Nice! I posted two. Woo! Okay, 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 okay. I boosted away from uh, from uh, FA at least one FA shot. Hello, how you doing? Hello, how you doing? Oh no, Hori missed. No Hori. Hello, Esteri. Come on, Ori! Farm, 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 farm! He missed again! God damn, who am I spotting to then? Artillery, it seems like you are my last hope. And ally artillery as well, please. Oh, too high. Stupid. <laughs> okay, that's very good for me though. That's very good for me because I can I can use this guy now as a hard cover when I spot. Oh yes, baby! Woo! Let's go! Ow, 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 ow. Nice. Spot to the get. Boom! There we go. D3 clutch. Boom! There we go. There is Effie getting shot as well. The best scout BZ, ladies and gentlemen. Forget the heavy tank feature. Ah? Huh? Wait, wait, wait. I received one damage right now. That's not fair, though. I was testing if I get spotted or not. Maybe. No, there is 183 in front of me. No way! What the fuck did you hit on me? Do you want to say he actually banged my commander hatch just as I clicked as well? No, brother. Unlucky. Next battle, though. And in the next battle, you see the power of uh, keeping, maintaining your jet boosters. Uh, how you are able to stack up endgame damage, uh, switch flanks and, and so on. While you still have a lot of charges left, you know, let's say in the middle of the battle. And uh, this one is prime example of that, so enjoy. And we use it now, just to get the maximum value. Like, look at that! Look at that! It's crazy how it just flies up the hill. This is dank where I actually feel the usefulness of this and the jet boosters. Nice. We got uh, like 
up over here together with the medium tank, basically. Yeah, lower plate is insta pen. Lomsadot. Hey Des, let's get going for the next months. Keep these streams up. Hello, soldat! Please don't see my lower plate. Please, please, please. Nice. Full burn. Beautiful, 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 beautiful. Very nice, very nice. But now we have to worry about that. The middle is safe. We're not going to get flanked from the behind. Not getting flanked from the behind, which is good. Good news. All right. Okay, uh, is, are there any rambable targets? No. You have to make sure you aim in your shots. Like this is once again one of those tanks which, at least for me, I don't know, maybe it's just my bad RNG. Maybe, maybe not, I don't know. Anyway, it seems to be another tank where you don't hit your shots unless you fully aim in, like, never. Nice one. We did 4.9k in the last game, so we need to do better in this one. That's goal number one. And we have uh, three boosts left, so let's go in. That's exactly my point, man. If you don't full aim in, it's GG to you. He's right over here. No. Okay, we can use our power uh, of going up the hill. Ah. Uh. No! He had full clip! What the hell were you doing with your shots up here then? Nothing. Ay, 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 he had full clip. Anyway, 5.4 thousand. We take that. I have played 22 battles with this right now. I can, I can say like... I have played quite a bit of battles, let's say. I like it more than I first... When I first started playing. It felt like it doesn't have too many good things going on with it, but the more I, you know, as always, the more you play, the more you get used to the tank, the more you see the strengths and weaknesses and you're able to adapt a little bit, right? The gun handling is better than on BZ, but it is still kind of derpy. You need to full aim in your shots and so on. Minus 8 degrees of gun depression is nice, saving time, like, okay, accuracy, okay, you know, average, but sometimes it's just way too derpy, especially if you don't full aim in your shots in this tank. 560 Alpha is nice. Penetration numbers, I saw someone in the chat asking as well. It has 260 with 1000 velocity and 320 with 950 velocity and 65 with HE. So 320 is like... As far as heat penetration goes, it is on the lower side. We have 330 heats, we have 340 heats, we have 300 heats as well, but you know, on autoloader, for example. Uh, but... Um, and turbo, the, the mobility, if you have turbo, at least bounty or bond turbo, it's in the jet booster mode, is quite nutty if you use it correctly. Like in the last battle, um, how I was able to go all the way around the, the map in the middle gave me two extra shots of damage into Rhino, right? And the behind the 60 DP and so on and so on. Too bad I missed the shot into Hori. Then we could have had a 6k game, but 
that shot was also a nice proof of what I'm saying. Like, you need to full aim in your shots unless they go wherever they please. Arbor-wise, it doesn't feel very reliable. Also, your fuel tank gets damaged super often. Super often fuel tank. I have already been set on fire as well. I have been set on fire from the front and also from the back. So, the fire thing is happening. 400 base view range is good. Very good, actually, because you can get 445 or higher without much effort. Uh, so, yeah. Outside the, uh, outside the turbo mode, the mobility is not bad either. 19 power to weight ratio with turbo. So, yeah, I would say before when I said it's average, let's say it is average plus slightly maybe above average but still if you get it congratulations if you don't get it you are not going to miss out much the fun factor of this tank comes into effect when you use your jet boost like when you're able to escape when you're able to chase when you're able to ram when you're able to climb with your jet boost this tank is very fun in those where does it say that? Does it say 10 seconds? Anyway, in those 10 seconds. So, at least you are able to have fun in this tank for 50 seconds in the battle, guys. <laughs> you have 5 charges, 10 seconds each. At least for 50 seconds you are having fun. You are either flying, ramming or escaping somewhere. So, there it is. Let me know if you are going to pick it up or not, guys.